the Joe Rogan experience. Some people are really into people being really into them. Yes, he just wants to be admired. I, I've known some women like that who are into dating trolls. Oh, I mean yeah, trolls yeah. because they've never had a woman like that and they're like, the fuck? And they're just My dirty sister and, had a friend like that. So her friend was only into guys that she knew she could do better. <laughs> oh, it's fantastic. <laughs> she wanted she wanted them to worship her. Well, there's a there's a there, apparently there's a psychology where a lot of men will overfeed their wives and get them super fat so that what? they don't step out on them. Oh, jeez. There's a lot of this, there are a lot of subconscious behaviors that go on. God, why are people so goddamn crazy? I don't know trauma. You know that like Carl Jung? Is it the Carl Jung uh, fucking? Uh, line that says that which we don't work out in our subconscious we will act out as fate in our lives Oof. how about that because you will relive patterns you'll relive mm. trauma you will relive these patterns yeah. and you'll do it on your own terms and you'll wonder why you keep fa why do you keep dating the same person why do you keep falling into the same problem why after two years does this go bad what what is that well there's a way to actually creatively f f at least sit with that and observe it and, and be aware of it that's what therapy does yeah it is you make the unconscious conscious that will direct your life and you will call it fate what a great quote wow until you make the unconscious conscious yeah i mean there's a lot of fucking strings pulling on you it will from direct the back your life your and you will call it fate knowing your own darkness is the best method for dealing with the darkness of other people yeah Ooh. Well, that's what Nietzsche, that's why I like Nietzsche. Nietzsche's, Nietzsche's idea was like, look, man, you can have these false models of life, which is a lot of times life is a bitch, right? And you're not going to, you're not going to be able to compete or you don't want it. So what you'll do is you'll go, it's okay. Meek will inherit the earth. That's all right. I'll, I'll, uh, you have money, but is he happy? Is he happy? You know, there's a lot. Well, we make all of us do this. We make excuses to not live our best life. And he was like, nah, live dangerously and uh, try to be the best you can be. Just work your ass off. And if you have to die, if you have to take risks and die, leave a good looking corpse. It's the idea of turning your life into a fucking circus. <laughs>